from the IHTN studios, it's Braves Beat. What's up, Braves? Welcome to the last episode of Braves Beat for the first quarter. I'm Mark Bennett. And I'm Ethan Higgins. Hey, Ethan, did you know today's National Pet Obesity Day? Perfect. <laughs> Let's get into the news. The students for the Legend Makers team have been announced. Congratulations to Chris Hooten, Juan Sean Lin, Haley Henry, Jack Brunner, Anna Wyatt, and Sarah Bridge, who will all be seen around the school capturing the year. The team can use your help too. If you take a picture at an event and send it to Mrs. Pfeiffer, you can earn up to 20 super fan points. This year's homecoming was a huge success. First, let's check out some clips from the pep rally last Friday. We had over 30 sports teams and clubs take part in the panel painting and the parade. After that, the lightning didn't stop the dogmen as they took the dub over the Taylor Yellow Jackets 62-13 to in the homecoming game. Now let's see how some of the students and teachers took on the dance Saturday. Good try. Damn, the party in the USA. I can't do this. Please take it away. Let's get it. It's all I know how to do. Oh, yes. Dad. 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 Uh, I love Indian Hill. You don't even go to the school, man. This is so good. I have an amazing Jungle vibes right there. So fun here. They did such a great job decorating. This is the time you guys get to take a breath from your studies. And just enjoy a few minutes. This is all about you guys. What up, guys? How's it going? Yo, this place lit! Junior Diana Yu is making a difference worldwide. Best or Better Education for Stronger Teeth is her nonprofit organization that first began as a high school project. She has devoted a lot of time towards moving the project forward and raising awareness for dental hygiene in rural China. She spoke with us saying that she has been able to achieve this all thanks to her friends and Procter and Gamble. Diana and Best have helped more than 7,000 children in schools throughout the world. Keep it up, Diana. Did you know that last year, our Indian Hill High School students volunteered over 40,000 hours? Check out this picture from some of our Braves who volunteered on this past summer trip to Peru. Great work, Braves. Let's get the number even higher this year. Today is the last day of this year's first quarter. Grades will be finalized soon, so be sure to meet with your teachers if you have any final questions or concerns and meet with your counselors if you have any questions about next quarter. Enjoy the long weekend, everyone. Now let's check in with Luke Johnson for this week's edition of Hot Ones. Hey there, Indian Hill. I'm Luke Johnson, your host for Indian Hill Hot Ones. And today, joining me with these works of art is our very own art teacher, Ms. Pfeiffer. Ms. Pfeiffer, we're so glad you could be here today. How does it feel? It feels great. It's kind of an honor. I wasn't sure I had enough facial hair for this endeavor. All right, then let's uh, dive right in. Starting off today with the bomb because we have a new sauce in our lineup. I'll tell you about that a bit later. All right, right. What is your favorite medium and style of art? Wow. <laughs> yeah. It's, okay, it, it takes hurts. a while for this to kick in. Yep. Um, I'm trained as a printmaker. I can hardly see you now, Luke. <laughs> Tears. Tears in my eyes. I'm right here with um, you. I'm trained as a printmaker. Most of my work now is painting. All right. Um, favorite style? Probably I'd have to go with abstract expressionist. Mm -hmm. Yeah, bright colors, shapes. Bright colors. God, I love each and every one of them. Alrighty, let's uh, dive in. Why not? Okay. The quicker you oh do it, the gosh. quicker it's over. Obviously, I gotta ask, what would you be doing if you weren't a teacher? Oh, gosh. Um, there's so many things on the list of other things I'd like to be doing. First, let me say, I love what I get to do. Of course, yeah. <laughs> um, if I weren't teaching, I would most likely be living in a tiny house in Montana. Oh, Montana. Uh, just painting every day. 
That sounds like a dream right now. Yes. Alrighty. Ready for our newest sauce? Ready? Don't you have another question? <laughs> yeah, when we get the next wing. Okay. Alright, so, debuting Mad Dog 357 Silver Edition, 750,000 Scoville units. I can't wait. Thanks, Luke. Bus Driver Appreciation Day is next Wednesday, October 17th. This is a wonderful opportunity to show our bus drivers and transportation department how much we appreciate the care they provide for the students each day. This year's fall play, The Crucible, starts this Thursday, October 18th and will continue for Friday, October 19th and Saturday, October 20th. Be sure to get your tickets and come out to support another great production by your Theatre Braves. That's all the news we have for this week. Be sure to follow us on Twitter, subscribe to us on YouTube, and email us with any school updates. Hey Mark, how do you make tissue dance? How? Put a little boogie into it. Stay classy, Indian Hill.